Love can change the world in a moment. There's a song that says so. I've reunited with my greatest friends and even started making new ones. I've got a place to call home at Cassidy's. I'm helplessly in love with Paris. I'm laughing and smiling more than I can ever remember. Life is... good. Hey, I'm Seth. I'm supposed to pick up a check from Laird, but maybe I'm early. Paris usually looks after it. Oh, okay, let me check where he is. Looks like he's here. Let's check it out. He won't take long, he showers fast. So you and Paris play in a band? Yeah, designer children. Oh yeah, Elise played me one of your records. It's pretty good shit. Thanks, you should come check us out sometime. Sounds fun. So, what do you do? I work over at Shadowfax. No shit, I wrote some tunes for a run of ads you guys did. The Funk Box. That was you? It sure was. I guess that answers my next question. How you make a living playing music? I mean, I can't imagine playing the Marlin and selling a couple of records once a week at Laird's store pays the bills. Not yet, but things are coming along. We've got some great contacts and we're really building momentum. Well, good for you guys. So tell me about Paris. Don't you already know her? Like, she's with... Elise. Yeah. Yeah, she's been around. But I mean, like, What's her plan? Elise is very important to me. I want to make sure she's in good hands. Well, Paris is an incredible woman. She loves harder than anyone I ever knew. Weren't you two an item once upon a time? We were, a long time ago. She likes to commit romantically. I'm just not wired like that. Yeah, I guess it's tough when you're a rock star. <laughs> Why the hostility? I'm sorry. That was shitty. I, I lost Elise once for a long time because I was stupid. I just don't want to lose her again. That's cool. Paris is not going to take her away from you. From what I can tell, Elise calls her own shots. You hit the fucking bullseye there, Seth. Well, well, well. Now that is a sexy man, eh, Seth? Oh, I think so. <laughs> hey, man. How you doing? Good, how are you? Not too bad. Good. Uh, how's your sister? She's great, man. Honors again this year, even with all that time in the hospital. They think she could be back on a horse in a year or so. Really? Yeah. That's incredible. Well, good to hear about your sister. Um, you want to go for a beer tonight? Cassidy's ditching me for a movie marathon with Elise, so. Can't. Band practice. Maybe tomorrow night? Deal. I'll show you a test. Cool. All right. I'm off. All right. See you, man. Bye. So. Oh, no, 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 no. To the shower with you, woman. Fine. Go. I worked at a hospice for my placement. Watching people lie down knowing that they were never gonna get up was, yeah, that was tough. 
So did you finish school? I did, but I knew I was never going to pursue it. How come? Well, I met this man, Cecil, and his heart was shot, but his health was too poor to have a transplant. So he's basically just sitting around waiting to die. And no one would ever go in to visit him, so I started going in early to try to keep him company. Anyway, he had this small framed painting of a woman on his bedside table. It was, it was awesome. He had painted it 40 years earlier for this woman he was in love with. And when he showed it to her, she said she didn't like it or him. He was crushed, obviously, and he never painted anything ever again. As he lay there dying, he regretted ever letting that rejection be the reason he gave up on his gift. Do what you love, even if it hurts, he said. Life is very, very short. Yeah, so I got my degree. I hung it up on my wall, and now I go work at the motel because it lets me do what I love. How are you even a real person? <laughs> I mean, the money's a total drag, but you just have to trust the passion and see what happens. Oh, you just rhyme. All the time. <laughs> Not on purpose, though. Okay, well, I'll have a killer jam sesh. Enjoy the Buffy Marathon, okay? Mm -hmm. I'll call you tomorrow. I will, and you better. Okay. Good night. Hey, you ready to party?